Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We are working on the 57 Chevy convertible today. Right now we're uh, de, uh, descaling the uh, chassis. And uh, this way we can get it completely smooth so I can spray it. And then we're going to be uh, taking off the side mounts. And then uh, I'm going to be adding a uh, four-link suspension in the back here. So this is all in preparation. We are also going to be doing the uh, floor in the car in the next two weeks. So stay, uh, stay on the channel and uh, keep watching for new videos. It's going to get fun. More grinding, more grinding, more grinding. Got all the brake lines removed off here. They were still on. And uh, we'll be getting down to the end of this at some point. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a little bit more finer sanding with one of those uh, little cookie wheel things to get into some of the small areas. And then, uh, I got some Port 15 ordered up, and uh, we'll blacken it. So I got to take off these rear mounts. Gonna chop an X into these and use a air chisel, pop them through. So all righty, all right, painting day. We uh, got everything all cleaned off and sanded. These are getting cut. Don't worry about that. There's some, still some crap on them, but yep. 415 will take care of everything. Um, you could paint a lot worse stuff than this, but the chassis is probably looks terrible in camera, but it's uh, nice and smooth and I acetoned it and but I got the front stub uh, up to here on. It's looking good. It's poor 15. It's at a brush. Makes a freaking mess. Don't get it on your hand. Ask my girlfriend about that one. Maybe we'll even put a uh, picture in of her hands first time. But it's got great gloss. So it will uh, dull off a little bit. So it won't be as shiny, which is fine by me. All right, I'm going to get back to it. And uh, no need to uh, watch me brush paint of chassis. All right. Well, it happened. You got to paint it looking good some may be saying hey why are you painting this and then cutting it and grinding on it well <clears throat> today's a really nice day the wind is well the wind kicked up a little bit now but before it was completely still and uh, it's nice and sunny and it's warm so it was one of those days where uh, I don't know when I was going to have this type of day again. Um, it's not real cold where we are in Arizona, but it's cold enough where it affects the paint. So we're going to be removing the leaf spring mounts after I get my kit. I should be getting my kit today or tomorrow for the four link. Just want to make sure it's not a piece of crap before I go into the... Uh, uh, can't go back way. Well, I could always put them back, but that would be stupid. And then a lot of people cut these mounts off. This is for the uh, bell housing. You know, because of header clearance. Right here is a hole, and that's, I believe, to another uh, body mount uh, for the car. 
So being this is a convertible, I want to take advantage of having every, as many mounts as I can. So what I want to do is I'm going to cut this in a way where I could um, box it in a bit, but be able to get the bolt in and utilize the mount, but cut most of this off so I could, you know, have my good he header clearance. So we'll get into that at a whole nother time when we're fitting the engine. So, well, anyway, it's uh, looking good and shiny. And uh, it's one of my uh, least favorite jobs doing this, but it was uh, nice and peaceful. Sat here, just painted a lay like Bob Ross on a, on a, with an easel. So, all right. Next we'll be doing is all the uh, framework. So look forward to that. Like, share, subscribe, tell your friends. And uh, we will see you on the next one.